hello everyone welcome to root to mathematics in this video we're going to solve this interesting so here we have given a equals to 1 plus root 5 divided by 2 then find the value of a to the power 12 so here we have given a equals to 1 plus root 5 by 2 which is also called as the golden ratio and we are also asked to find the value of a to the power 12 okay so without any delay let's just start the solution okay so we have given a equals to 1 plus root 5 by 2 let's just simplify the value of a first for that we'll cross multiply so by cross multiplication we have 2a equals to here we have nothing means 1 so this must be equals to 1 plus root 5 now this implies this i'll take this 1 to the left hand side so here we have 2a minus 1 equals to root 5 in order to remove this root over i'll square both side of equation so 2a minus 1 whole square equals to root 5 square this implies this here i'll apply the algebraic identity of a minus b whole square which is equals to a square minus 2ab plus b square now considering a as 2a and b as 1 so you can write 4a square minus 4a plus 1 equals to 5 this implies is 4a square minus 4a i'll take this plus 1 to the right hand side so 5 minus 1 is nothing but 4 here i can divide 4 both side of equation so by dividing 4 we can write a square minus a equals to 1. So this implies this a square equals to a plus 1. Let's just take it as equation 1. Now in the next step I will multiply a both side of equation. So by multiplying a we can write a cube equals to a square plus a. Here you can see that here we have a square and from equation 1 we have a square equals to a plus 1. Let's just substitute a plus 1 in place of a square. So by substituting we can write a cube equals to a plus 1 plus a which is equals to a cube equals to 2a plus 1. So what I asked to find, we are asked to find the value of a to the power 12. So I can write this a to the power 12 as a cube whole to the power 4 3 multiplied with 4 nothing but a to the power 12 again i can write a cube whole to the power 2 this is also equals to a to the power 12 so here i will do two steps of squaring in order to achieve a to the power 12 so now squaring both the side we can write a to the power 6 equals to 2a plus 1 whole square this implies this a to the power 6 equals to 4a square plus 4a plus 1 a to the power 6 equals to 4. Again from equation 1 we know that a square equals to a plus 1. So here I will write a plus 1 plus 4a plus 1. This implies is a to the power 6 equals to 4a plus 4 plus 4a plus 1 equals to a to the power 6 equals to 8a plus 5. Now, I'll again square both side of equation. So, by squaring here a to the power 6 becomes a to the power 12 and here we have 8a plus 5 whole square. So this implies this a to the power 12 equals to 64a square plus 25 plus 2 multiplied with 8a multiplied with 5. This implies this a to the power 12 equals to 64. Again I will replace this a square as a plus 1 plus 25 plus 80a. This implies this a to the power 12 equals to 64a plus 64 plus 25 plus 80a. So here we have 64a and here we have 80a. This will get add 
so adding we can write a to the power 12 equals to 144a plus 89 so we have already given a equals to 1 plus root 5 by 2 as a substitute the value of a here so we can write a to the power 12 equals to 144 multiplied with 1 plus root 5 plus 89 divided by 2 this implies this a to the power 12 equals to 72 plus 72 root 5 plus 89 this implies this a to the power 12 equals to 72 root 5 plus 161 thus a to the power 12 equals to 72 root 5 plus 161 is our answer i hope you have understood the solution thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for more such interesting videos thank you